NCTV45 presents The Thought for the Day. Monday through Friday, we give you a message of spirituality and inspiration. Your host is Habakkuk 3, verses 17 and 18, which says, Though the fig tree does not bud, though there are no grapes on the vines, though the olive crop fails and the field produces no food, though there is no sheep in the pen and no cattle in the stalls, yet I will rejoice in the Lord. I will be joyful in the God of my salvation. With no buds on the trees, there was no hope for a harvest. To rejoice during disaster seems totally inappropriate, but faith in God adds a new dimension. Faith assures us, just as it did Habakkuk, that even when things seem hopeless, our all-powerful God will eventually restore us. When bad things happen, we are called to rejoice in God our Savior. Paul echoed these words when he wrote to, um, when he writes of joy that he had regardless of circumstances in Philippians chapter 4 verse 4. Now to rejoice it is helpful to start with a thankful attitude. With thankful words we communicate our love for God. This in turn revives our hope and then additional reasons to be grateful. Then we find reasons to rejoice in the midst of trials and tribulations. It is at these times that God gives us a glimpse of his glory and miracles. And that's our thought for today.